Hi, there's people in the town for music festivals of different kinds. Heavy MTL has landed at Parc Jean Drapeau for the next couple of days. And then there's Montreal's Vocal Arts Festival. Here's Aphrodite Salas. Last week at the Montreal Vocal Arts Festival, tonight at the University of Montreal's music faculty, French tenor Michel Senecal will give a public master class. This coming Thursday at the Museum of Fine Arts, a dozen musicians from the Orchestre Metropolitain will perform. And next Saturday, August 17th, the festival will wrap up with their gala concert, featuring some of Canada's most promising young singers. Over on Parc Jean Drapeau, the stages are almost set for some 35,000 heavy metal and rock bands that are expected to spend the weekend at Heavy MTL. It's for everyone who likes loud music, heavy music. Uh, they've got something for everyone. We've got a diverse lineup. It's not just heavy metal, it's not just punk. It's, it's a bit of everything. Andrew Arsenault's band is going to play the festival for the first time. The reason that metal is so exciting is because it, there's so much energy, raw emotion, and heart, and talent that goes into it, no matter what genre or what type of band you're watching, it's always going to be exciting. New and heavy MTL this year is in between show entertainment. A wrestling ring has been set up next to one of the stages. Professional wrestling is good versus evil. It's raw emotion turned up to the 11th decibel, and I think that there's going to be a nice crossover between heavy metal music and professional wrestling. Some 25 local wrestlers will take part, both Saturday and Sunday, with seven shows a day. We're going to go out of our way to entertain some people will get hurt. Some people will smash into each other. There'll be bruises. There'll be blood. And there'll be a whole lot of music to move. Tickets are still available for Heavy MTL. They cost $65 per day. And you can access all the shows, including the live wrestling.